So whilst researching the Franklin Ace, um, I came across uh, some information about um, how um, Steve Jobs and Wozniak decided to put an Easter egg into the uh, Macintosh computer. This is after the Apple II incident and after they'd won the case against Franklin uh, Computer Corporation. They decided to put an Easter egg into the ROMs for uh, the Macintosh so that if in a courtroom the Macintosh was, was, was copied, they could walk up to the copied machine, type in a command, and it would, uh, it would, it would show an icon that said stolen from Apple. So, um, uh, and they did this and they hid it in the ROM. Um, apparently, um, they compressed the image, uh, and they made it quite hard to find so that the, anyone copying it wouldn't realize it was there. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'm just booting up this Mac. Um, it's not a 128K or a, a 512K. Uh, so this is the Macintosh Plus, And I think, uh, I, I think this will still have the same original ROM with the, the hidden Easter egg image. So let me just go uh, into about Finder. So I'm just going to zoom in a bit. Um, okay, um, so what you have to do is press the um, interrupt button, and I have a uh, Q-tip that I'm going to push. Uh, there's a button on the side, uh, and you can just kind of push it in the side of the case. And uh, this is the, the, the debug prompt. Um, and now I've got to type in a... Um, uh, a command there. Okay, so the spacebar needs to be fixed. I'll, uh, I need some deoxit on that. Um, so one one eight. So this is the command that you type in. Um, and again, this is um, Steve Jobs and wasn't there. Imagine, imagine doing this in a courtroom, and then what it would show is this little thing up in the corner there. And you see that it says stolen from Apple computer. Oh, there you go. So it's just a small icon uh, with a little Apple Apple logo, stolen from Apple computer. There you go. It's still there. So this computer, the Franklin Ace 100, was in part what caused Apple to put those Easter eggs into the Macintosh ROMs. If you want to find out more, follow the links at the end of this video.